You got it? Does it say record? Yeah, you record. Okay, all right. So we're doing this game here, and I'm teaching him to circle with the punching hand, go underneath, and push. Okay? It's a game for early student grades to learn how to dissolve energy or how to absorb it, actually. So I'm telling him to do the same thing to me, and he can't push me for some reason, even though he's way stronger than me. I can testify to that. Okay? Alright, let's stop now. <laughs> okay. And the trick here is that when he pushes me, I let very little resistance happen here, but the further he pushes, the more resistance I give him. And then at a certain point, I'm pushing him up. So I'm forcing him to push me down, so he's making me more stable rather than pushing me over. Okay? That's one trick. But you can also do it by simply telling him to push me forward, and, and I'm not going up at all. You tell me when I'm starting to go up, okay? Okay. Now don't go, just go right here and lean forward, that's right. Okay. <laughs> He's going up a little, it's a little, it's a little, yeah. it's a little. Uh, the way you're pushing, it's starting to have to go up, okay? Because you're kind of pushing me up, but if you only go forward, there you go. Try to push down a little bit, maybe. There you go, that's it. So now I can't really go up. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, so this one is a little bit different because I'm not giving him the trick where I'm forcing him to push me down. I'm just finding a different way to redirect what he's giving me into my feet. And it's not going up to make him go down, but it's simply extending my energy forward. So right there. <laughs> okay. And you can test me by doing that when I'm doing that. But him pushing and suddenly letting go and see if I go anywhere. I'm not falling forward, so I'm not doing this. 